<coughs> There's a Mumbles man's car. The Mumbles man's got the guru with him. They had a, they wanted to come a little earlier than I wanted to go. It's like 11.30 now. I think the tide's low in two hours. <coughs> but i got to take Jack to the vet. Jack's got some kind of rash or something that's been bothering him. He's got a big hot spot on the side of his face. So i got to take him to the vet at 3.30. That means I gotta leave here like 2.30. But that'll be okay. Can't let my Jack suffer like he's suffering that scratching crap. Stand by. It's rough as bricks today. They're getting ready for the Neptune Festival this weekend. We got a big festival down here, sandcastles. I'll take you down here looking for some sandcastles. They're really nice. see the guru and Mr. Denny off there in the distance. I doubt you all be able to see them, but I see them. The guru's in the wash area and the Denny's on the mid-beach. Got a bad undertow here today. <coughs> Stand by, we're headed down. see no holes anywhere they dug. That's bad. <coughs> Not one hole anywhere. Target. That's the first hole I've seen. Guru's right here. Guru. You got me on a ball spot here? You got me on a ball spot? Ball spot? Yeah, this ball spot we're on. You didn't see me fall long ago. Uh -huh. Wait, I was up my up my ankle when a wave hit me and knocked me flat on my back. <laughs> I'm not kidding you. Where's all the holes at? I don't see no holes nowhere. Nothing coming down here. Now you see Denny dig but one hole. Yeah, I'm dug down. Down? That's interesting. It's funny, Beaver came here last night, had a big night. Found a gold pendant, found uh, two dollars and some cent worth of change, some sunglasses. Low tide, yes. Yeah, I know. Well, let's get going. We'll find something maybe. Guru said they had a dime. <laughs> they got two of these. That's it's, it. It's hard to believe Beaver found what he found last night. Right. And we can't find nothing. I ain't right. dug anything yet. Yeah. You see the guru said he got knocked down. Yeah. <laughs> you do that? <laughs> Pretty nice. My wife don't give me much. This ah. is about the only thing she's ever really given me that ever matters. Pretty cool. Thank you very much, man. Can I? Can I? Felix from Charlottesville. Tesoro PI. I'm How you making out, buddy? I'm still at it. I ain't turned up much this morning. I got a, I got nothing coming down here. 
I was up there looking for a guy's ring. I found 36 cents. You might do what you're doing down here. This is my take so far. We've got one quarter and yeah, I think it's still on the pound. It ain't like it was last night for Beaver, is it? No. God, 12 no. hours made a lot of difference down here. Yeah, it is. Yeah. That's my old scoop. Made by Steven. Yeah. I think you yeah, met him last year, year I before last. He be coming this way, baby. Okay. He gets a mumble, so he gets, wants to leave, but he can't leave because he's riding with us. <laughs> okay. I saw another guy on down. Yeah. Yeah, the beer down there. <laughs> I think he must have kept on going over the way. I never just see him coming up close to me. Quarter and a hundred bobby pins. You saw him. That's not very funny. I got the money. I did find thirty-six cents up there looking for that guy's ring. A quarter, a dime, a nickel, and a penny. I have found nothing down here. The first target, first target. Sounds like 25 meager cents. Forty-six. Who would ever believe that? Maybe I looked at it wrong. Now this is a junky, junky signal. Jumps all around. I think it. I'm pretty sure it's junk. Might be a bottle cap. But I don't have anything to dig. I might as well dig something. Just to see what it is. I know it's no good. First I gotta find it, I guess. Get it out of the hole. Oh, well, we said it's seven inches deep. It's not a belt buckle either. It's a piece of goddamn aluminum. Yeah. Well, I got my exercise for the morning. I don't find anything else. Target number three. Target number three. Sound like a quarter this time, not no damn penny. Better not be no penny. 12.46. Enough, I know that. I got Brutus with me today too, big old Brutus. Come out of there, 25 cents. I ain't believing that. <laughs> I just can't believe it. We got that sucker now though. Brutus. Come on, Brutus. Come on, water. Come on, baby. There you come. That's my baby. Get that baby out of there. Yeah. There's that 25 nigger cent. You see it? You sucker, you. Wow, hot goose. I found a lot of gold with that scoop right there. Fella had cancer and died. Made that scoop. Well, he made some nice scoops. Yeah, give Brutus a try. You might like old Brutus. I believe it's a hairpin, to be honest with you. <laughs> Ah, damn, please, no yeah, 
This is 25th Street. This is one block short of where I come in at. I'm getting ready to go home <clears throat> it's uh it's funny how this place can change in 12 hours you know it happened to us a couple times already beaver hunts the evening low tide and has a klondike and we come down for the morning low tide and it's like we've been on a ball spot all day we were i mean <laughs> like i said you'll see pictures you'll see beaver stuff what he found last night at the end of the video and uh, so we were expecting, we were excited. We were expecting to have a pretty good day down here today. But down the road that went. 12 hours. Unbelievable. I got to get home to some two Filipino pineapple knives. I picked up Saturday. I think you probably saw them if you watched that video at the market. A re restoration job. And sharpening. One great big one and one kind of big. Okay, I'm homebound. Pineapple knives. Before. Jack's first ride. Yeah. What do you think of that, big old Jack? You ain't gonna like it where I'm taking you. No. You're gonna be mad when you get there. You ain't gonna like that old veterinarian place. No. But right now you like it, don't you? You turkey, you. Big old Jack. <laughs> That rain we weren't supposed to get is trying to show up now. Not heavy yet, but meager, meager rain. I gotta pee on all these bushes before I go in. I don't like it in there. I'm damn glad to be out of that place. On my way home, see Dottie. 
I know she's fretting, boy. She frets when Jack gets not around. It's unbelievable. Jack could care less, but man, she's really upset when, when he goes away. They bonded some kind of way. I don't know why. Now we'll be home in a second, Big O' Jack. I got the knives done. I got them on a separate video. They're not pretty nice, considering what they look like. <laughs> 